Welcome to the video world and again this is Miss Cara and we're going to discuss today about biology 9. So all you need to do is listen, relax and learn. I'm going to show you an image, this one. What can you see? A bubble, an egg, or anything as you can think. But this picture is represents our topic for this time. That is vacuole. Vacuole is from the word vacuous meaning empty. Vacuole is a storage bubble found in cells and they can commonly found both in animal and plant cells. But in plant cells, that is much bigger than animal cells. As you can see in the picture, this is the vac vacuoles of the plant cell and this is the vacuoles of animal cells. Vacuole is also a store food or any variety of nutrients a cell might need to survive. They can even store waste products so the rest of the cell protected from contamination. Eventually, those waste products would be sent out of the cell. Vacuoles is have its support and help to its cells itself. At isolating materials that might be harmful or a threat to the cell. At containing waste products as I have said a while ago, it's containing water in plant cells, it maintaining internal hydrostatic pressure or trigger within the cell, it maintain an acidic internal pH containing small molecules, exporting unwanted substances from the cell, and allows plants to support structures such as leaves and flowers due to the pressure of the central vac vacuole. In seeds, vacuole stored proteins needed to germination are kept in protein bodies, which are modified vacuoles. One term that connected to vacuole is tonoplast. Tonoplast is a membrane barrier that limits each vacuole. This membrane is remarkable in that it can surround a small amount of fluid and then after a short amount of time, during which water is taken in, stretched to become an organelle, occupying as much as 95% of the cell by volume. And all this happens without the tonoblast losing its integrity as an active membrane. In this process, all the other organelles in the cell are pressed without damage against the firm cellulose cell wall. Tonoplast make the vacuoles flexible space but never empty space. The state of plant cell vacuoles indicates whether you need to water your garden. A cell in which the vacuole contains all the water it needs is to said to be in a certain state. A state of flood shows a shortage of water and a cell is said to have lost its circle. Also, a plant building on a hot summer afternoon may pick up the evening but a plant building in the evening or morning needs some water. Vacuoles assist with growth, as you can see in the picture. The relatively high hydrostatic pressure produced by vacuoles also assists in cell elongation but only when the cell wall is made soft enough for extension to take place. It also have a chemical to help to create a cell pressure. Chemical in the vacuole forming as concentrated solution create the hydrostatic solution to produce within the plant cells. Some of these chemicals form ions and the effects of this system is to create a high osmotic pressure. It 
this high osmotic pressure that has power to pull in water molecules through the tongue of rest until the salt is turkey. Next, the vacuolar membrane is a selective membrane. The vacuolar membrane or tonoplas is a selective membrane and the passage of chemical through it is controlled in both directions. Water can pass in out freely but other small molecules are retained within the vacuole. Molecules to required entry tickets. Many proteins arriving at the cytoplasmic surface of the vacuoles are synthesized by the membrane-bounded ribosomes of the lot endoplasmic reticulum and transported to the vacuole via Golgi apparatus. In the Golgi apparatus, they are given a combined address label and ticket, and the address part of the label on a protein directs it to the vacuole, and the ticket portion helps it gain admission. The vacuolar membrane is also worked as a proton pump. Part of the vacuolar membrane works as a proton pump and uses energy from adenosine triphosphate or ATPT, this one, to pump hydrogen ions into the content of the vehicles. This maintains acid condition inside it, keeping it waste on site can attract and deter. Okay. Keeping a waste on site can attract and deter. Plants, unlike animals, do not have a well-developed excretory system, but they do have vacuoles, and vacuoles provide safe storage space. When chemicals are produced in plants, they can temporarily or permanently start. So vacuoles and lysomes have similar functions. So vacuoles is an endowment for the next generation. But protein, fats, and carbohydrates can be safely stored in the vacuoles. So as a summary, a vacuoles is often considered to be the plant equivalent of a lysosome in animal cells. From the point of view of its ability to break down a large molecules under acid condition, and this is certainly the case. So thank you for listening to Pedia Words.